want to tell you guys about a just a really weird dream I had last night. Now, in my dream, I'm walking down the street in Brooklyn. I'm pretty sure it was Brooklyn, but it could have been anywhere in New York. I'm walking down the street and I'm just like hopelessly lost. I don't know where I am. I have no clue where I am. And to be honest, I don't remember what I was looking for in my dream. So I walk up about a, you know, about a hundred, hundred fifty yards away. I, there's a, the, the steps going down to a subway platform. And standing in front of that are a couple of uh, police officers. So I walk up to the two cops and ask them if they knew how to get to this place. They seem to understand my question, but their response was they started mooing like cows. Okay. I got frustrated and got out my phone, got out Google Maps and put in the place where I was looking for. The, the voice in uh, Google Maps, I like to call her Siri Light, she started moving. And then as I kept walking, I was surrounded by more and more people. Everybody was mooing. They were all mooing like cows. I don't know what that says. I don't know what that says. Anybody good with dreams, feel free to comment below. Or even if you're not good with dreams and just want to kind of mess with me, comment below. This ain't the best McDonald's commercial I've ever seen. I don't know what it is. Nothing, and I do mean nothing, bothers me more than lazy people. Lazy texters, especially. I'll give you an example. I texted a friend of mine to come over and look after Pete this afternoon while I'm at work. My text was such, working today and tomorrow, you know the drill, Agent Mutt thanks you. His response? will do. Okay, I, I can accept that. But then my response to him was also, would you mind when you go over there to close my bedroom door? My friend's response, okay. Power tube. <laughs> Power tube. I gotta admit, this has been a rather emotionally draining week for me. Um, learned some things about myself that didn't know that I really wanted to know. Uh, and, uh, you know, just kind of felt like I was... As the old saying goes, road hard and put up wet. <laughs> but uh, tonight I think really 
really help things. I had dinner with a couple of dear friends of mine, Angela and Chad. Thank you so much for the invitation. And, um, you know, dinner with a couple of people that I, you know, truly like. Um, also ran into a couple of other uh, good friends of mine, uh, Johnny and Heather. So, um, sometimes I guess it pays to live in a town where you know everybody. Unlike where I'm going to be in just a little over three months, where I'm going to live in a town where I maybe know two people.